Hello friends, it's Kathy Clement with Kathy by Design. Welcome to Make and Take Tuesday. This is a little weekly series on my blog where I share a tutorial using a new-ish paper collection, tool, die, product, design, and we make something beautiful together. This week I've got a masculine birthday in my family, so I've pulled out my Photo Play DIY Home Edition. This is such a cute masculine collection and I know a lot of you struggle with masculine cards and you've asked me in the past to share more masculine card designs with you so I'm going to show you today how to make a very quick and easy um, fancy fold card for, for a guy. You're going to need two 11 by four and a quarter inch panels and you're going to score these at two and three quarters and five and a half each of them, okay? So the very first thing we're gonna do is cut a slightly smaller piece of this diagonal stripe paper. I've got five and three eighths by four and one eighth, and I glued it on top of my center panel here. This is the large panel. And then I took an oval die and set it along the top, ran it through my die cutting machine, and then slipped a little piece of patterned paper in there behind it to make this little pocket. Then I put gussets on the back. Gussets are just folded pieces of paper that act like a hinge. You can see these are about three fourths of an inch wide. I folded them in half. The important thing is that they come up to the top of your paper and that they don't go over the sides. The folded edge always goes along the open edge. And if you haven't seen me do these before, you can watch any of my other videos and I do gussets all the time. So they're one of my favorite things. The reason I like to do a gusset is that it gives you the full width of your pocket. Whereas if you use adhesive, you're going to lose part of your pocket width. So I'm going to line this scored card up over the other scored card and now you can see we've got this great gatefold design and I'm just gonna press this down and it can open like this and just like that it's a super fun card for the little wings on the inside I cut this fun nuts and bolts this is two and a half by four and we're just gonna glue this down like this. It's always easier to do the inside first, I think, before you've got all the bulk on the front of your card going. Oops. And then I'll put these over here. So we're already looking super cute. Then on this panel, I've cut another piece of paper. This is the measuring tape, same size. Then on this panel, I have added quarter inch score tape on the top, the side, and the bottom. And then I prepared, this is the same, this is a five and a half by four and a quarter of black that I've put this piece of the tool paper on and then added a sticker across the middle. And we're just gonna line this up. Oops, it's always harder to do on camera. and press this into place. So now our card opens like this. And this is a pocket where I can put this little journal card. How fun is that? You can also slip a gift card in there. So now we're here. Then to decorate the front, this is a three by four card that I didn't like the sentiment on. So I took this great sentiment that says plain and simple, you rock, and I cut it down 
and matted it on that back that three by four background. I punched some holes and added some screwdriver brads and this cute little metal hammer and some pumpkin thread, which I'll hit this with a, a tad bit of glue to just make that stay in place. And I put foam tape on the back. And you can see I wrapped baker's twine. This is pumpkin baker's twine that you can get from really reasonable ribbon. All right, once I've got this position where I want it to be, I will go ahead and glue this down on my front cover. And I like to keep guy cards pretty simple. I don't do a lot of, uh, you know, wild embellishing on masculine cards. They just seem to do better. Then for this inside pocket, let me show you what I prepared. So this is gonna open here. I'll write a note here. I'll put some cute little images here maybe. Then this pulls out. And then this is our pocket. Now, so that I don't glue, put things into the wrong pocket, I'm gonna put a little adhesive. And this is not a full sheet. That's just a small piece, all right? But here's our pocket. And here's our card. That slips into the pocket like this. See how fun that is? So now we've got this extra fun little layer up here. And then on the inside of the card, I just have blank spaces where I can write my message and stamp a happy birthday. So that is the basics of how you make this fun fold card for a guy. Super simple, quick and easy, really adorable. And guys are gonna like it. As a bonus, you can mail this easily. So there you go, guys, how to make a masculine card. I'm going to embellish this one up and get it in an envelope for our son's birthday, which is the day after tomorrow. So I'm running pretty close to the deadline here. All right, guys, thanks for joining me. Kathy Clement, Kathy by Design. You can see finished pictures of this card. They'll roll at the end of this video. Go get your craft on. Bye.